By the end of this video, you will be able to find the song ID numbers for songs that you would like to use in your Roblox games. Let's get started. So the easiest way to find song IDs is actually to go to roblox.com, make sure that you sign into your account. And once you're signed in, you want to go to the create tab on the top. Once you click on create, you're going to notice that there's a tab for creator marketplace. You want to click on that. And then when you click on creator marketplace, you're going to look for audio on the left hand side. So you're going to click on audio. And then this is the audio that is available for you to use. Many of them are free to use. So let's say I would like to use this song right here, Arcade Weekend. So you can hear what that sounds like a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. So once I click on the sound that I like, you'll notice on the top address bar, Right after you see roblox.com slash library, there's a number. And this number is actually the song ID number. So this is the number that you want to copy and paste and then put that into your games that you're creating. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy that, so control C. And once I've done that, I'm gonna go over to Roblox for a game that I was creating. So let's go ahead and add this sound to my game. I'm gonna go to sound service and I'm just going to add a sound. And once I add that sound, I'm gonna click on the sound and then right down here where it says sound ID, that's what we we're looking for. That's the sound ID number. I'm going to paste. So control V and then press enter. And then now I'm going to go ahead and make sure that this is playing and I'm going to go ahead and loop it as well. So now when I play my game, the song will be playing. So you can see we were successful in adding the sound to our game. I wanted to point out one other way that you can find the sound ID for the games you're creating in Roblox. If you don't want to find the ID in Roblox.com, but you just want to find it while you're working in Roblox studio, then what you want to do is go to your toolbox and make sure you click on audio for the marketplace. So you have a marketplace and then audio. And then I'm going to go ahead and just find now this will work. You can find the sound effect or music. And let's say we want to use this traffic noise. I'm just going to click on that. And then I'm going to right click and then just click on copy asset ID. So when I copy that asset ID, the number was copied. And when I go over to the part where I want to add the sound, I'm going to find the sound ID. I'm going to go ahead and paste that into the sound ID. And now I've got a different sound in there than I had before. So those are the two ways you can find the sound ID, one through roblox.com and one in Roblox Studio. So you now know how to find sound IDs within Roblox. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other Roblox Studio tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.